Why won't Superman invest in Bitcoin? Because his weakness is crypto. <laughs> Yo, what's up guys and welcome back to Something Unlimited. I didn't play this two years ago, you did. What was I doing? Tyler seems to be concentrating on a spell. Best not to interrupt her. Why not? I want to interrupt her. Cheetah is in the hideout. Cheetah, I need you for something. Oh yeah? How much does this something pay? 100,000? I don't even have uh, 10,000. Um, alright, I could use a little boost. I'll need that up front. No offense, Lex. You don't have the greatest track record. Are you Cheetah for 100,000? That's too much money. Hire her. You don't have enough money. Yeah, no. Why even bother me then? She the storms off. Aren't your services a little bit expensive? You're stealing me. You knock on Mercy's door. Just come in, Lex. I know it's you. You step into a room. Well, who else would it be down here? What do you want? Just thought I'd see if you're still brooding down here. I'm not brooding. I just needed some time to think. Maybe you're right. I usually am. Mercy rolls her eyes and sighs a bit. <gasps> I mean, about me being an adrenaline junkie. I've got a tummy gun next to my bed for God's sake. I feel naked if I don't have a gun on me. Exactly. Embrace your true nature, my dear. Do you really want to be one of those drags out there? What's a drag? We're hundreds of feet underground in a massive secret lair. One piece of equipment in these labs is worth more money than they'll see in 10 lifetimes. We fight gods and we'll win eventually. Eventually, like, uh, step by step. Slowly. No one could pass this up. I I'm sorry, Lex. I just need to think some more. All right, I'll leave you be. I know you better than you think. You leave Mars in the room and head back upstairs. I'm gonna be honest, I'm a little bit lost in this game. I need a way to make money. What it is now? Seems we have another interested party in our little venture. I see. Someone worth considering? I'll let you decide. He wants to speak with you personally, eh? I thought it was a she. Well, we can set up a meeting then. That won't be necessary. He's here right now. Roulette walks off and a man steps out of a dark corner. Corner. It's good to see you out of jail, Luthor. Vandal Savage. I don't know much about DC, so I don't know who's this guy. A savage. What do you want? I've heard about your little brush act here, and it piqued my interest. Alright, so what is your purpose showing up here? Come now, I'm still a man even if I am immortal. I just happen to be in Metropolis. My interest is pearl entertainment. First, you could give me the budget to uh, fix this place up. It's a mess. Right, I'm sure that is completely true. I thought I'd stop by with the present since you could could probably use the help right now. Savage ends you a small stack of wrapped bills. You received 200k? Oh, I can hire Shita then. And uh, what do I have to do to pay you back for this? Nothing, of course. Like I said before, it's a present. I've been imprisoned many times and it's never enjoyable returning to society with nothing. I don't know how these guys get caught so many times. They go to jail, but they still always go, go back outside. Well then, I appreciate it. I have to be going. I hope your business is successful, Luthor. Savage takes a look around and he walks back to the door. Roulette quickly scoops up the small stack of bills and disappears with him. Did she just steal me? After a couple minutes, she reappears and strides over to you. Seems we have an enthusiastic supporter. I won't be too quick to trust Savage. He never does anything without some reasoning behind it. So don't jump in bed with him right away? Got it. I won't jump to bed with him. I don't know what you mean by that. We can really use this money right now. Yes, use it for now. We don't have a choice. He didn't ask for anything right now, but that doesn't mean he won't eventually. If we can get at some of his vast resources in time though, he could work in our favor. Roulette perks up for a second. Um, I like the sound of that. Some vast resources. She zones out, pretending to adjust her glasses. Money, 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 money. Just stay on your guard with him. Of course. And with me as well. Not here. Let's talk in the office. You both had to relax office in the back. I just wanted to ask you if you wanted McDonald's. So what did you want to talk about? Girls, money. Why not both? Girls. Everything is going good with the girls. I trust you're going to get some more? Of course. These things take time. If we move too quickly, the justice league will be all over us. If I can't just have a bit to upgrade this place, yeah, yeah, I get it. We just got 100k. You need money. It's a girl's best friend. You'll get some more when I get some more. For now, work with what you have. You're all business, Lex. You need to learn to mix in a little pleasure. Somehow I have a feeling your pleasure involves money anyways. Well, of course. I'm not a very cheap date. Well, keep things on track and we can both relax a bit when we're in the green. Just don't forget to throw me a bone now and then. I've got to get back to work. Yeah, chop chop. Buy. Give her money? A present for me? How much is it? Give her 30k, 10k or 5k. Let's give her 30k. Lex, baby, it's such a nice stack of bills. How sweet of you. Money will catch you everywhere with me, honey. Roulette rubs your arm lightly. She turns and walks away. Swing your hips in an exaggerated fashion. No doubt 
showing off. Okay, but I can I get something because I gave you 30k? Oh, great. What do you want? Jaxi, old boy, old pal. Just tell me what you want, Joker. Then get out of here. Oh, don't be that way. Shall we vet our differences? Last time I got involved with you, it cost me 200 million. And I barely have 100k now. What's a couple hundred mil between best of buts? In fact, I've had a run of bad luck lately. You don't say. That pointy here to run and that shut down all my operations in Gotham. Ooh, Harley Quinn. <laughs> nice outfit. I'm impressed you can dress yourself. What are you supposed to be? A janitor or something? Hair-headed clown groupie? Drained mucky butler? R-word juggalette to S-word? <laughs> That's it, you uptown overdressed street the bad girl. They're afraid I'll beat you again in fair fight. Don't kill each other, dudes. Drink something first. Oh yeah, come and get it then. Ali and Mercy start to fight on the floor. Anywho, I've got a plan to steal some chemicals from Star Labs. With them, I can make some Joker toxins strong enough to cheer up all of Gotham. I just can't wait to see all the smiles when I come home. Oh, like that little town in One Piece where everyone is laughing all the time. I'll pass. I've got enough to deal with already. Besides, stealing from Star is suicide for you. You don't even have any powers. Lexikins, I'm so disappointed. At least give it the old clown college try. No. Go away, Joker. Fine. You won't get to see the smiles on the children. Children's faces. You don't involve children in this? Come on. And the parents, old people, dogs, I guess, and uh, well, everyone really. Ali! Let's blow this Donald's dungeon. What, you gonna fight now? Uh, what happened with the both of them? Keep fighting. <coughs> <laughs> Coming, Mr. J! You got lucky this time! Yeah, you better run, clown! <laughs> Mercy, stop fooling around! They were beating each other to death! And go clean yourself up! It's disgraceful! Right away, Lex! Why me, universe? Well, maybe Joker will finally get himself killed and out of my way forever. It's the little things you have to look forward to. <laughs> the little things. That's a big thing. Who's this? Gicante is in the hideout. Can I hire her? Gicante, I need you for something. Yeah, Lex? Oh, okay, she got it because she's a giant. Okay, I'm gonna wait a little bit more until I have a little bit more money. Sorry, honey, I don't work for free. I understand. I need more money. Lex, darling, thank you for this work job. Now I can continue my research. Well, I don't trust magic, but I'm not foolish enough to dismiss it. Just make sure my investment in you isn't wa wasted. Don't worry, baby. I feel so with the true power of my magic. But... But... I will need much more money, darling. Everyone needs money for me. Of course. Course. Even magic is going to cost me money. Sorry, baby. Many ingredients and items are very rare and expensive. As long as it proves useful, I'll see what I can do. Thank you, Lex, darling. Dallas lights up besides you and rubs your shoulders. I really need a massage now. Now, seriously, for, for real. My big song master will uh, take care of me. She wraps her arms around your arm. You pull away from Tala. Please don't touch me. I've got to go back to work. Someone has to pay the bills around here. Yes, Lord Lex. Tala boss before. For you. Lord Lex has a nice ring to it. Lex Summer? You're right, Lex. I'll admit that I was right if you admit that you were wrong. Mercy rolls her eyes and looks away. She has to stop rolling her eyes or else you're gonna get stuck in there. You were right and I was wrong. Happy now? Of course. Good, Lex. Why do you do that? I'm not trying to patronize you, my dear. I just want you to accept who you really are and who I really am. Fine! I'm a thief and a killer. Yes, I need this crazy life. There you go. I can work with that. Thanks, Lex. I should have listened sooner. Taking my advice is always a good idea. I don't know about that, but okay. Now we've got work to do. Right, let's go. Let's go where? You say let's go as uh, I know where to go. Lex, I could really use some muscle here. So, you have some cronies, don't you? I do, but they're spread thin already. These earrings bring in the cash, but also different crowd of customers. Some even have powers or close to it. Regular bosses just don't cut it. <sighs> well, I guess problems are always going to come from unique properties like this. I can deal with it for now. But as we get more girls in here, it's only going to get worse. Alright, but supervillains cost money. Don't expect Darkseid or Black Adam. Is Black Adam a supervillain? I've watched the movie. It's, he's not supposed to be a, a villain, right? Maybe an anti-hero. But also, The Rock never wants to be a villain. I'll get some seal research for you. That's all I need. Just if they see someone, at least they'll think twice. I'm not promising anything. I'll see what I can do. So resourceful, so helpful. 
called a girl could uh, get used to such a great partner don't patronize me shouldn't you get back to work oh uh honey -huh, you just wound up too tight maybe when i get some free time i can straighten you out really work out those knots i don't know if i know what she means lex i've got an idea all right what is it let's go on a heist like the good old days i want to knock over a bank or something um that's some heat we don't need right now oh come on lex i thought you wanted me to embrace my true nature of course my dear but not to get us potentially thrown in prison for a whim don't worry i have an idea just give me some time to work out the details okay i'm excited to hear it so we're going on a heist lex you seem stressed out let tala help you with that i do work harder than anyone i guess it's getting to me tala begins to massage your back you'd right here on the shoulders oh yes so many knots i will work them out for you baby ah yes that's a spot very good thank you darling lex yes i need to talk to about something oh great more money what it is now a lot of my materials are still at camdus cadmus i was wondering if you could get them back well i'll see what i can do i'd have to organize the ice to steal them back thank you baby i will make you some magic items if you can get those materials it's always something well i have a lot of things to do tonight you lock the cadmus ice okay so we can go on the ice now but i still need money i found the perfect place for my meta bordello don't you mean our and i thought this was going to be the meta bordello our place is a good starter but it's far too exposed and it would cost too much to modify that extensively it will have to be hidden from prying eyes so what's your plan don't worry about it now partner i've got everything well in hand i'm confident you won't disappoint oh, i'm very good with ends honey i don't know if i know what she means by that let's hire shita you enter a sealed case nice what's his job i'll keep you informed when the plan comes together i'll lay a little till then shita goes back to the table to counter money but that's a lot of money okay let's go for a large amount of cash this eyes has a 40 percent chance of success proceeds only 40 proceeds i don't feel too good about this it was a success okay good okay 40 percent is good mercy grace pull off their eyes successfully you gained 354,513 dollars not bad at all so are you finally going to tell me your big plan very well i'll tell you on the way to the surface okay let's go you start to wet to the surface as you tell mercy the plan you both walk down the hallway to the elevator i don't know about this lex it's perfect no one expects to get robbed at a coffee shop we're gonna rob a coffee shop certainly not by lex luther and mercy graves i guess you could cut down on a hero factor here exactly all right i'm ready let's do this right now right here good you crowd control i'll enter the employees you stand up in the middle of the diner everybody be cool this is a robbery any of you effing bricks move and i'll execute every mother effing last one of you you stole 589 dollars uh, from the customers i just stole 300 thousand why well, don't need 500 that was a lot of fun lex we should do things together more often of course that will be grand ice and schemes to come my dear maybe we could do some other stuff too well i've work to attend to good night night lex you tomorrow are you serious dude come on you've unlocked mercy's costumes huh where are those costumes i will help you relax master good girl tell has been unlocked as a villain you can command oh finally dance Dally will show you my best dancing baby you just relax master you pull up a nearby chair and sit down okay so now she's gonna dance for me her dancing is pretty impressive Della will dance anytime for you baby excellent i can uh, dance anytime for you as well looks i'm going to start preparing the site for the meta bordello i've even got someone on board to be my proxy and run it you're not going to be running the meta bordello you could have told me this beforehand who is this proxy don't worry lex she's a veteran and can handle herself i have too many other side projects to run out of this place i'll still take care of money honey she'll run the day-to-day -day operations fair enough as long as the money keeps flowing can be bizarre for all i care i'll get the place running as soon as i can she'll whip it into shape in no time whip it Catwoman. other than that everything is going good to with the glamour slam excellent i'm looking forward to seeing your progress another high successful let's go 260 000. okay a little bit less than before but it's still money warning louise lane has been seen snooping around glamour slam make sure to throw her off your trail how do i do that on daily planet you notice someone still working away at the desk well well burning the midnight oil louis oh jesus lex you almost gave me a heart attack what rock did you call out from under well it's not really a rock you're not more concerned with me breaking into your workplace for you to do something this small time that's a good reason come to give me the scoop of the century are you turning yourself in on a silver platter oh please i definitely make more of a spectacle of something like that i have some interesting information for you you still report the news if i'm not mistaken maybe i should go find k 
can't. I wonder what that pumpkin is up to this time of night. <sighs> Alright, I'm listening. I have it on good authority that Mandragora is running a smuggling ring. Pier 12, warehouse 43. If I wanted to take a random guess. Uh, just a random guess. Okay, so why you tell me? Can't an upsetting citizen report a crime? They were reporting in the middle of the night? Right. I thought you were on a run after you broke out of prison again. Okay, so uh, he broke out of prison. He, just, he didn't just leave. Minor details. It's in both of our best interests if Mandragora is taken down. Well, think about it. I've got work to get back to. Right. Don't let the door hit you on the way out. Why would I slam the door in my face? Why'd you tell her all that? You want to take the dogs from Mandragora? I don't care about Mandragora or the dogs. I just wanted Louis to think I do. Someone has to take the fall. Yeah, but why her? One thing I can always count on with Louis Lane is her ability to pursue a good story. Taking down an entire smuggling operation is far too juicy for her to just sit on. She'll be out there tonight checking that down. It'll keep her off our backs for the time being. Okay, so that's why we told her. Let's get back to work. Right, nice job, Lex. Oh, I cannot use it while it's under construction. So no more ice for now. Well, it looks like you survived. You're more durable than you look at least. No thanks to you, my competent Harley. It's not my fault, I just got confused, pardon? I'll give you confusing. The Joker smacks Harley in the face. That's domestic violence, don't do that. Oh, Mr. J! The Joker kicks Harley off into some crates. Jesus. Lexikins, I'm hurt. I've been thrown off buildings, fed to the sharks, and blown up more times than I can count. But I always got the last laugh. <laughs> Yes, yes, you're the Joker, I get it. Now get out of my way. Oh, Lexi Poo, can we reminisce about the good old days? Like the time you blew up a $200 million laboratory of mine? Or when you kidnapped me and crashed my Lex Winky to the ocean? I can't even remember a time you didn't cost me time or money. <laughs> When you're right, you're right, old Ben. So I guess we better not break tradition. I really hate you, but that's for times and all that nonsense. It'll be a real shame if old bad brain and a boy in blue found out about your operations. Straight up blackmail? That's low. Fine. What do you want? I don't have time to deal with you and the Justice League. I knew you'd help out a friend in need. It should be a simple thing for a super scientist. I just need the chemicals from Star Lab for my new and improved choker toxin. And I'll be out of your hair. Oh, wait a sec. That might be tough to pull off. <laughs> because you don't have a hair, Lex. Haha. <laughs> you better do it quick! Or we'll check that butler skate out of a bitch! The Joker hits Ali with the butt of his gun. Pow! Ow, budding! Quiet, you! Kids these days! Don't know when you keep their big stupid mouths shut! Fine. If that's all it takes to get you out of my city, I just knew you wouldn't let me down. Now you better not take too long or the details might leak out. <laughs> Alright, just leave me alone. You better watch yourself, uh, dumbass secretary bimbo with a hat. Having trouble thinking up insults with your tiny clown, uh, brain? That's it, dice, gang! Must and Ali fight each other on the floor, yet again. You've unlocked the Star Labs lies. Guys, the good, good, of course, awesome, and bye.